2005, a chance encounter brought the Living Compassion team to Cantalumba, a community in Zambia with no clean water, widespread malnutrition, no safe housing, no access to medical care, little opportunity for education, and no formal employment. A community where residents reported that seven in 10 children die before the age of five. Nearly two decades later, through the gifts of attention, of care, of friendship, of love, of participation, of joy, of celebration, that chance encounter has blossomed into an inspiring collaboration. Today, Cantalomba is a community with clean water, safe housing, access to medical care, and growing educational opportunities. A community where over 1,000 children receive daily nutrition through Living Compassion. As we have watched Jen participate over these many years, Heather and I wanted to know, how can we assist? Education was the clear answer. The children who were preschoolers at the beginning of this program have become the first in their families to finish high school. They are the pioneers in their community, ready to be the first to go to college. Education, to which access was a foregone conclusion in our lives, is the on-ramp to employment and to a sustainable future. Having the opportunity to see the children grow into young adults in these last years, it has become so clear that the future for one is the future for all. As we look to send our own children to college, helping to secure their future, we are moved to support Living Compassion as they support Cantalomba to do the same. As Rachel Cobway, a nursing student and one of the first four young women involved with Living Compassion to attend college put so eloquently into words, my success in my education flies a flag for me, for my family, for all of Cantalomba, for Zambia, for the world, for us all. Won't you join us? A gift of $35 pays a semester's tuition for one girl in primary school. A gift of $50 pays the college examination fees for one young woman. A gift of $100 pays for the accommodation for a semester. And a gift of $500 pays tuition for one semester of college. As these young women graduate from college and secure gainful employment, they will be positioned to invest back into their own community, funding the education of their own young sisters, neighbors, and friends. It is a gift to be given to, and it is a gift to be able to give. A gift of any size gives a future of love, of care, of collaboration, of opportunity, of reciprocity. This young woman is heading to college. How about this young woman 